All right, let's see if this works. Oh, we got a major leak. We have so many things we're gonna do today and Ooh. kind of having a girl's day while being productive at the same time. It's gonna be fun. Both just got new running shoes. They are so cool. Look at them. Woo! So pretty. My shoes had holes in them and they were getting to a point where it just kind of hurt to run because they were that worn down. We're gonna go test them out and go on a trail run. Then we're gonna get lunch with my mom. It's gonna be a great day. Trails are up in the foothills. Let's get these new shoes dirty. Ooh, new shoe day. New shoe day. Let's do this. We just ran five miles in the foothills. It was hot. It's like 88 degrees out right now. And but we, we saw did a rattlesnake. And we saw a rattlesnake. Actually, I didn't see it. I heard it because I was in front that time. The only time I was in front. And heard the rattlesnake. And all of a sudden, Jenna goes, ah, Rattler! And then we had to book it forever. But we didn't get bit, so we survived. Idahoan pizza, which of course has potatoes on it. It has potatoes, onions, bacon bits, cream cheese, and even has cream oh, cheese. It's basically jalapenos. like jalapenos. It's basically like a loaded baked potato, right? Yeah, I guess so. It's pretty yummy. getting Kelsey some art supplies because she's gonna start painting and doing her art while we're on the road and it's gonna be like another way that's kind of like our job well she's gonna make it like her job so, which is really exciting um, and she's gonna try to just sell her art so we can make money on the road hopefully hopefully it'll be good I mean I know her painting is really good um, but hopefully she can like start her own like art business and make it what she wants to be what kind of paintings do you usually do? I think I'm gonna focus on landscape abstract paintings or abstract nature paintings. Mm. And I'm switching to oil pastel, which I've worked with in the past, but I'm switching to it because I think it'll be easier to bring on the van. It'll be take up less space. And less space is always better when you're living in a van. We are at Corbin's brother's house. We are going to start working on the van. We have a whole plan for the next four weeks. It's pretty intense, but I think we can do it, especially if we get some help come up. We've got a lot to do. We're gonna fill up the water tank, which we haven't done before, and gonna check to see if there's any leaks. On RVs, there's usually two water inputs. One of them uses the water pressure from just the city water pressure. And then the other one is to fill our water tank and then we have an internal pump that creates water pressure so that when we're not hooked up we have fresh water. So right now we're testing the one that doesn't go into our tank. So we're going to test all of the water features with the city pressurized water first. The whole thing comes out! Uh. Here goes the shower. Oh, sounds good. Oh, there we go! We got water! Woo! Okay, I'm gonna turn this one and see where it's coming from. It sounds like it's outside. It's down here. Oh, uh, I think this is the gray water. So the plug-in just to a hose definitely leaks. We're gonna have to look at that. Um, we're now gonna check the tanks to see if the tanks leak. It's going. Oh, is it leaking at the back? Because that would be so gross. Yeah, it is. We tested the water going into the tank and the pump works, all the hoses are good. 
it's really just the connections to like the toilet and the sink that are leaking majorly so we'll have to fix that but i mean the shower works the toilet works the sink works we just need it to work well and not leak we came to my family's house for dinner we didn't vlog the dinner because <laughs> we were so hungry and we just ate all the food but we are here with family uh -oh. visiting hi grams <laughs> hi this is my grandma and my mom and some girl <laughs> And Sonny, and my dad. <laughs> you forgot to say some pretty girl. She yeah. is pretty. Thank you for dinner. Yeah, it's thank good. you guys. It's very yummy. It was very good. We had chicken. I'm sorry we didn't show you guys, but it was actually really good. <laughs> oh, Paris. Paris just got really attacked by a dog. I'm still really upset about it. We're going to get a snack, and this dog was sitting there, and Quibbin had Paris on a leash, and then he like, wrapped around him and he was gonna hand him to me and then he let go too soon. And then he just booked it to this dog. And this dog just like attacked him, just bit his poor little tummy. And he's so scared. Oh. The dog like shook him in his mouth and like bit down. But he was tough, huh? I think he's gonna be okay though. You're a tough guy. He looks like he's doing better. Oh, he got his back too. Oh, we had a long and kind of scary day, huh, Paris? We're gonna go ahead and get to bed. Thumbs up if you like today's video. Thumbs down for aggressive dogs. The dog that attacked him was pretty aggressive. I mean, Paris did like run straight towards him. Are you okay, my love? Yeah, I'm okay. I think he's gonna be okay. So I'm okay. Yeah, but I just think if dogs are gonna be aggressive, then you should. I don't know, like. If it's gonna bite other dogs, obviously, like put a muzzle on it or don't take it out. But anyway, we do videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday now, and be where your feet are. She can't find where to turn on the water, and it's really funny watching her. Okay, that's a start.